everybody, welcome to the Orange Road. This is the first episode of the live coverage of the World Team Championship in Hereford. So, uh, me and Jethro drove from our country, the Netherlands, straight up to Germany, where we met up with the first of our other teammates. Uh, we are here in view. Right side, me, Jan Willem, then we have Jethro, then Menno, and on the left side, we have Harm. At this moment, we are not yet joined by uh, our other two teammates, so we'll see them later in a picture. So uh, we just went straight to the event hall first to kind of sign up and have a look at the terrain and um, the hall and everything else. And yeah, it's a really impressive sight uh, to see all those tables ready. One of the coolest things I saw was this immense poster on the wall, or a couple of posters showing all the different matchups. And probably my sound is going to be crap because I'm recording this at our hotel room because, yeah, we are just too old to stay at the venue because, well, we need our sleep when we're drinking. So yeah, uh, it's really cool to see. I'm, I'm, I'm expecting they'll probably have a bunch of stickers that will probably go up during the weekend, showcasing just all the uh, all the matches, the rankings, and everything else. Tables are basically are there's a lot of terrain on the tables though, a lot of walls. They were still putting down terrain because we were quite early. Uh, Spain, by the way, is in the top left there. I think we were the third or second team actually showing up. There's also uh, some stuff being sold at the venue, like this unique dwarf model that's uh, one of a kind. And yeah, it's just uh, really cool to see all this stuff. It really makes me happy to see the Night Age logo on boxes and everything else. Most of this stuff is uh, from Rotten Factory, if I'm not misunderstood. Could be wrong here, but I thought everything was from Rotten Factory. Really cool locking models. So, uh, gonna take some time to uh, really look at them tomorrow or again, maybe buy a few. and. Uh, then we got our mystery box, and wow, it's a really, really, really big mystery box, as you can see here. First we got was that Dwarven model you just saw, so uh, one of us will get the lucky Dwarf model. I'm kind of sad because I'm the sixth player, I'm non-playing captain, so no goodies for me. But yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff in here. Uh, key cards for all the players, nice and easy to see who is what. Then we have... Uh, all the different cards for best sportsmanship, best painting, and everything else. Even more of them. Then we have this um, one of the uh, flyers, also for the Rotten Factory. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, Rotten Factory as well. Cool artwork on the back of it. Then we have uh, this, uh, this flyer. Let me get it, uh, get it good in view. 15% off on all miniatures, which uh, is going to be quite fun for our team. And there's another 5% discount flyer right here for the team. Or 5, five euros free, I think it is. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a really nice nice gesture from a Rotten Factory. Then we get to uh, this incredibly cool box. I'll have Harm help open it here. And in this little metal container, we have all the matchup cards for the matchups and these cards are yeah they are really really gorgeous to look at it's really impressive to see just how much work and effort has gone into this box we'll probably all take these cards home as a really cool southern souvenir of this weekend and then we get to the last really cool thing it's uh, oh it's the voting ballot first yeah was only that one and then we get to the dice cup, and it's not just a dice cup. Let's let's get it straight right away. It's filled with even more goodies. So first up is the logo. Again, kind of sad that I won't have one because I'm the sixth wheel on the five wheel wagon. There's a couple of dice in there, ten or twelve or something, with the logos of the club and of the event, everything else on there. Really cool, really clear dice. Then we get these cards, they are the flux cards. Also really handy to have. A lot of people still don't use them, so I think it's a really good idea to have them at the venue. Yeah, and then we get this big piece of rule book with all the, all the stuff we need to play uh, at the event. So yeah, awesome, awesome goodie the box. 
Okay, I'm gonna keep the rest of the video really short because everyone is here now. Uh, we're, we just had dinner as well, so uh, really good food. Really happy with Hereford. It's great to be here. Had some nice schnitzel, probably the best way to start this German event. And I'm just gonna, come, I'm just gonna put this down and get a couple of beers with my teammates. All right, everybody. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you all tomorrow on the Orange Road for day two, day one of the Night Age Masters Championship Masters, whatever you want to call it. I'm looking forward to it a lot. All right, bye.